Hi loves and welcome back to my channel. So we have another vlog today, but in this vlog I'm going to be showing you a new product that I have introduced to my body care routine. A portion of this video is sponsored by Sol de Janeiro, so keep on watching. So I'm sure you guys already know about the Boom Boom Body Cream. This cream and the signature scent speaks for itself. If you have this, which I'm sure a lot of you have already had, tried out, smelled it when you went in the store, girl, you know it smells so good. Once you put it on, your skin is so nicely moisturized. It's moisturized up until you take a shower. I love that when I put it on and then I go ahead and put my PJs on or my clothes or my robe i'm still smelling it so as you see here i'm putting on the cream first and it just really goes into the skin so smoothly moisturized it doesn't give like a super shine or anything it really soaks into your skin very well but let's get into the new product okay girls so let's get into this boom boom body for mental oil this is a non-greasy fast absorbing moisturizing and firming oil this oil is literally the extra step that you need in your body care routine if you already don't have an extra step <laughs> go ahead and add this to it and make it extra extra it literally smells just like the boom boom cream so the iconic smell is just <laughs> even more iconic with this as you can see it's just giving my body that nice glow from within girl it's just so nice and it's that perfect glow that's not that sticky type of oil type of feeling to your skin like all the lint is gonna stick to you no girl if you are looking for a new oil to add to your body care routine, this is the oil that you need. So I will leave everything in the description below for you to get yours now. Make sure you check them out. And thank you for Sode Janeiro for sponsoring that part of this video. Enjoy the rest of my vlog. Well, I don't know if this is the beginning of a new vlog. I'm not sure yet. <laughs> but it's the beginning of my new week. It's Tuesday, November, not, not November, January 17th. I just got back in town. I've been gone since Friday. And um, yeah, I was gone for the whole weekend and I just got back. 
So we're getting back on track and on schedule. I am working on finishing up my Miami vlog, New Year's vlog with some other miscellaneous type footage in there. So yeah, I'm back home. It's um, not freezing or super cold outside, but it's gloomy. Seems like it was raining. Um, it's not raining at the moment, but it's not really pretty out. So you guys can't see my address. <laughs> I have some packages that I want to open. So let's go ahead. I'm the crazy. One. Let's go ahead and get it open. First of all, well, actually, let me go ahead and show y'all my outfit that I got from Lululemon. I don't think I showed y'all, but I got this in my last, well, before I went and left for the weekend. This jacket's a size eight. I kind of wish I got a six because I want it a little tighter here. But. Love this color, and I love how it is boot cut. I don't know if you guys can see me, but I love the boot cut. I love that they're actually long enough. Like, they're actually really long enough. Um, these are the Align 32-inch um, pants. They're super high waist. These are in a size 6. I also have a navy blue pair in a size 4, so I can go back and forth between the two. These are like super high waist, but yeah, this was my airport outfit. Super comfortable. Um, I had it paired with, this trench coat from Zara. Um, I kind of only wore this so, cause I packed it with me and I wore it with one of my outfits and I just didn't want it to get like super wrinkly, so I kind of just threw it on. Um, I wouldn't like really wear this as like an outfit. I'm not, I'm, I mean, it's not bad. Um, but yeah, I had this on for my airport outfit and it kind of went with the weather because it is wet outside, so. Yeah, I got this from Zara. This is in a extra small, small. I believe it's out of stock though. I saw this in store one time in Zara and I was like, Oh, I should have got it. Went back and it was gone. So I went online, ordered it, and it, I think all the sizes were sold out except for extra small, small. So it fits. Um, I think it's more like an oversized. But this is super cute. Um, yeah, I'm gonna take this off and we'll open some packages. All right, so let's open some things. Um, so wet but yeah i ordered another froth there for my coffees because i needed a new one i think this is the same brand actually as the one i have already it is but this one came with like little stencils so if i put like brown sugar or anything in my coffees it will show these it has a hard snowflake rose and a smiley face and it also comes with the little frother cup cute Ugh, all this stuff is wet. Like it's been raining. Oh, this is, um, I believe, the robe I had. Oh no, this is my Jesus is Calling book. Oh yes, I've been waiting for this. It actually took like over a week to get here. What year is this? Or maybe it doesn't, cause I already got one in the year, it's wrong. Oh, okay, so it's not really, okay. So that one was more of a year, so it fell on us. It said like January 4th, Thursday, but I'm like January 4th is Wednesday. <laughs> okay, yes, this is exactly what I did. Oh, I'm so happy to have this. I've been wanting one of these. Um, the color is super cute. Let's see, today is January 17th. Come to me with a thankful heart so that you can enjoy my presence. This is a day that I have made. I want you to rejoice today, refusing to worry about tomorrow. Search for all that I have prepared for you, anticipating abundant blessings and accepting difficulties as they come. I can weave miracles into the most mundane, mundane. Hey Siri. How do you pronounce mundane? Okay, I found this on the web for how do you pronounce mundane. Check it mundane. 
Hey Google, what what does mundane mean? <coughs> Yes. Great. Here's an example of how to use mundane. Seeking a way out of this mundane, humdrum existence. Do you want to hear how mundane is spelled? No. Honestly, y'all, I've never heard of that word, so don't judge. <laughs> Um, I can weave miracles into the most mundane day if you keep your focus on me. Come to me with all your needs, knowing that my glorious riches are more than adequate supply. Stay in continual communication with me so that you can live above your circumstances even while you are in the midst of them. Present your request to me with the thanksgiving and my peace with which surpasses all comprehension. Will guard your heart and mind. I like this. Just what I needed. Experience peace in your in the presence of the Savior who is always with you. So that was January 17th page. Okay. Next. Um, smooth. Prep and plump essence. Ooh, I love an essence, you guys. Ooh, I'm excited about this because I love a good essence for my skin. I've been using the Tatcha one lately. But Rin Essence actually, I really like Rin products. So I'm excited about this. Lovely. The dry shampoo, y'all know I love me a good dry shampoo. Oh, this is super cute. Do y'all use these, honestly? Because me, no. I do like to sleep in pitch black and silent, but not with something over my eyes. I would like to join the freedom to open my eyes. You never know. <laughs> but they sent me, I love the packaging, The um, their dry shampoo overnight re renew, absorbs impurities, conditions scalp, Works while you're sleeping, calming scent. So I'm stocked up on two dry shampoos. I've never used this brand. I have heard it. I believe it's this brand in Target. Collab. I don't know. I'll let you guys know because y'all know the Garnier um, one with the cucumber, I believe, on it. Or the coconut one. Both of those work. Those are my favorite dry shampoos, like, ever. Like, they really work. So I have to give y'all the tea on that. Mm. Cute little packaging, I love that. Okay, I know what these are. I had ordered these sweatpants from Naked Wardrobe. So I hope that I get a fit of them. Got them in a size small, but they are oversized. I normally always get my sweatpants in a size small because I don't like super baggy, but I also don't like super tight sweatpants. I just go with, uh, I just know certain materials stretch a lot over time. Okay. The material, it's okay. I've definitely felt a lot better. And for these to be, let's see how much these were. For these to be $46, I actually like this, how you did that. Um, for these to be damn near $50, it's giving they're gonna shrink and get high water, but they're pretty long. They're just regular boot cut sweats. I've been loving anything boot cut lately. It just is a vibe. So, yeah, okay. We'll see how these go. I do like my um, Naked Wardrobe's um, like leggings, things. They have this one type of material that I really like that I think is pretty good quality. Um, I 
I don't know if I told you guys, but I ordered me the platform Ugg boots in the mini. This is a size nine. Yes, women's nine. I think they're so cute, you guys. I had to get them off stock X because they were literally sold out everywhere. Everywhere. Like everywhere. So I paid like, I think 200 for these. They came pretty quick, brand new. And let me go ahead and try it on. Let me go ahead and try it on for y'all. So y'all can see. I haven't worn Uggs y'all in so long. I don't even have the regular ones anymore. Cause I'm not really like a huge Ugg fan anymore. But these I just thought were so stinking cute cause they're platform. Like I've just been into platforms and I just think these are just so cute. Like, hello, not so regular Ugg. Uggs with a little bit of style to it, okay? Like, these are so cute. So cute, like, what? I had to get my hands on these, like had to. I just think they're cute, they're comfy. They're just a vibe, you know? I'm feeling it. So cute. Like, these are nine, I would say, they said go down a size, so I was gonna get a 40, which is like a 10, I think, yeah. But my toe is right here. So if I would've got a nine and a half or a 10, that would've been too big. <laughs> Literally, Uggs. My dad would always call them. They're named Uggs for a reason, because they're ugly. <laughs> okay, so here's, oh yeah, here's the candle, y'all. The Target candle. I have it turned backwards, because I don't be liking certain labels. It's not bad, it's like super plain and stuff, but. Yeah, so what else do I get? Let's see. Let me take my Uggs off. Um, I really don't need the box. Yeah, I don't need the box. <laughs> All right, um, I know what this is. Stocked up on my matcha, because my other one went out of Expiration date. I think this came with two. I think I paid like $25 for two of them. Yeah, it comes with two. This is the matcha I've been using lately, which I really like. Um, it's organic to 100% natural vegan, pesticide free. It's a Japan product. Um, consume within six weeks of opening and store in your fridge. Oh, wow. You have to store this in your fridge. Interesting. Because I've never stored my matcha in my fridge. Never. Okay. That is my little haul of things that I have ordered that was sent to me. Can't wait for my dresser to be here, y'all. I just can't wait. I ordered the curtain rods from Ikea so I can finish my rods finally. And I got some from my bedroom. Just been slacking. Like, I don't know why I haven't bought those. Just haven't. But, um... Yeah, Christmas tree is getting taken down, okay? So hopefully I have more things done for my home before the week is over or before next week or at least done by next week, the things that I've ordered and need up. But I am about to finish some editing. Um, I gotta run to the store. Then I might head to Kayla's because she made some good old food last night and asked, asked this to save me a plate. <laughs> We also gonna be talking about some um, things we are trying to do. Um, some content things, so we're gonna be talking about that also, but I have so much to do y'all like with house things. Like I need to really organize my closet. Like, ugh, it's just bad. 
The clothes are giving me anxiety. I can't figure out what to wear right now. It's hard to pack. And it's like, I feel like I have absolutely no clothes, but it's just because my clothes are just not organized in, in places that they need to be so I can see and think straight. So that is definitely on my to-do list. And if I don't get it done this week, I'm gonna feel like such a failure. <laughs> but anyways, my camera's about to die. Let's get into this vlog and hopefully we're gonna have a great week. We have some things planned this week, so let's get into it. Hello, please be careful. Oh, I just got home, still have like all my stuff on. Anyways, I wanted to show y'all Five is out of lamp, shade, okay. So I'm about to try this on. Oh, I had to go to Lowe's to get me this um, detachable heart, I guess is what you call it. Cause I need this for the lamp. Thought all lamps came with these, but they don't, which they should. It should either come with the lamp or the shade. Okay, there we go. I forgot how to do it because last time I had this same trouble. I'm gonna bring part, y'all. <laughs> hmm. Yikes. Okay, let's see something. Cause I'm thinking about it y'all. I don't even know if this thing needs this, actually. Hold on. Cause how did I have picked up these stems that I got okay so these two are from Target and these are from World Market these were $10 a piece these were $15 a piece I got two of these three of these Let's see. 
how the leaves done fell off already. Maybe I'll need another one. The leaves just keep falling off. Honestly, I think I like those leaves, y'all, over these ones. Like, I like the darker green. I actually really like that. So, I'm gonna keep that. I think the vibe is really, really cute. Remove this because I'm gonna put my new candle but i think this is so cute y'all oh it's coming together all right i have a candle i want to light up here too from diputique but i'm gonna like it i'm going to oh i forgot they gave me little matches um i'm gonna do this when i get back home but so far so cute. But I'm about to head over to Kayla's. Let me see how it looks with the light off. Oh, this is so cute. I love this. I just can't wait until I can fix that. <laughs> but I'm loving this, y'all. <clears throat> Such a vibe. It's so cute. And just simple. Let me turn up the lights in here. This is so cute. Like, I'm obsessed with this little area. Wow. Super cute. I think I'm going to move this a little bit more over. So it's not really in the... Near as much. This is so cute, y'all. Like, so cute. <laughs> Hello, Chloe. Are you gonna be nice today? Cause Louis isn't here. She was being such a bitch last time I was here. She would not share the toys with Louis. Louis, let me see if she's gonna play with this one. <laughs> You little thing. You wanna have a strip off? Where you put where you put them little where you put them bones at? I wanna see if Chloe gonna eat it. What bones the, the ones that oh I threw them out. Cause she pissed me off so bad. She really did with that. Like you never gonna eat that again. Oh, wow, I wanted to see. Dance for me, boo. Isn't this funny? I just went in my bag from Miami and just found all this. Yeah, the one that you gave me is in my beauty room. Just oh, took it out my bag. Yeah. Wonderful. Just wonderful. I think I want to add a little bit of salted caramel though. Mm. Oh, yeah. It's lit. <laughs> So I just got in some packages and one of them I know what it is. I had ordered and stocked up on a few Fenty body butters because I am doing a giveaway and I just stocked up my own self. Give me a sec. All right, so like I was saying, I ordered Okay, so doing a giveaway, and I'm excited about that. 
And I know I'm putting other things in the giveaway, just I'm not far yet. This right here is from Matrium. I have a cleansing balm, exfoliant, serum, moisturizer. Not gonna lie, this is a very, very good brand. They actually sent me their lotion. It's in like the yellow pump bottle. Fire. Great, great, great lotion. You know, I think my giveaway, I might just give away like some of my top favorite products. So, yeah. We'll see what I really, how I really want to do this giveaway. But yeah, that's just my little package. Um, little. Oh wait, no, I didn't even show y'all. So this got from Josie Moran. You guys, my their lotion, body lotion is amazing. Skincare face products, amazing. I use all of them. The body butters is one of my literally all time faves. That has been my favorite. Then you know, of course, the Fenty is really good too. This just has like more. This is like a shimmer. Um, and the other ones are just actual like body butters, but they just leave your skin so glowy. Basically, kind of how this does. Like they're different, but they're the same. You know. Oh, I just love them. But anyways, yeah, so they sent me this, which is, I'm loving because this is the vibe I'm on right now, resetting, you know, having my goals. Um, you know, I told y'all I wanna get into meditating and here they go. They sent me a meditation pillow, super cute, but they also sent me the their new um, Pro Retinol Mega Moisture Face Cream Brighten and Reform Power Without Peel. And I feel like my skin has been more on the drier side, so I have been using the Josie Moran um, Extra, I forgot what it's called, Hydrating Facial Cream. I think it's the night one, but I use it, girl, morning and night. It's so good. So I'm excited to use this. And also just have a meditation pillow, like, oh, so cute. And I love how she wrote me a handwritten letter. It's just like, girl, I know I wasn't the only one who got this, so for you to write all of this, Girl, and her handwriting is like the perfect cursive. What the hell? I love it. So yeah. Oh, subtract anxiety, fear, doubt, worry. Add peace, boldness, trust, fearless. I like that. Love that. Anyways, I need to get back to editing. I'm finishing in my journals, but the mailman just came and I wanted to open my packages. So let's get back to work. <laughs>
to rush and hurry up and throw on some stuff. I've been working all day editing, but I'm about to throw on some workout little clothes because I'm going to yoga. And y'all, there must be traffic because it's almost to take me like 12, 15 minutes to get there. And they talk about some, it's going to take me 23. And I need to be there before the class starts. <laughs> I don't got time for all this. Like, just come home. Like, I literally have no time. This top is from Story. Bottoms are from Gymshark, I believe. I need to get. I just ate. I really have to hurry up, y'all. Like, because I can't be late, but I was working on this vlog. Realized that I didn't edit this one part. Literally thought I was on track to have everything uploaded before I left. But I'm going to have to post the video probably like an hour later than I wanted to. So this video will probably be out 8.30 today. I wanted to do 7.30, but we're like 7. But that's not going to happen. My lips are so dry, y'all. to spray some of this. I have never used it, so I just need a refresh. Mm, it smells good. I just need to go home with her. Like, super quick. Get that back in there, y'all. Mm. I like the smell of this. Honestly, I probably should have used this at nighttime because it does say overnight renew. It's gonna have to renew while I'm in yoga. Okay. Did I just glue these back there? I didn't make my baby sneeze. Okay, clip. That in the middle, and you can take this. Do you have um, sriracha? Yes. Thank you. It's our first one of the night. I'm so hungry. I have a glass of reason wine. This glass is so little. It's so little. Um, this is our first time at the sushi spot. It's called Taco. Taka, yeah, T A K A. And this one is so good. Ooh, our food is here so fast. This is spicy. Right here? Yes. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. The white sauce? Uh, spicy mayo? Yes. Yeah. Can we have two of those? Yes. Thank you. 
was very very relaxing that was the first time i've ever done a yoga like that it was called the res restorative and healing i believe so i'm definitely like super calm um then we went to get sushi as y'all can see but now i'm back home before 10 and i'm about to shower tackle some clothes organize um my dresser is supposed to be on friday so i really want to get these clothes done like y'all it's bad right now. Like, this is literally me being just like in shambles because I cannot live like this. Like, my room, I need everything to always be put up and organized. Like, I really have like OCD um, to a certain extent. But um, this is also just from traveling. Literally, was in. Florida, where my parents for Christmas, then back to Florida and Miami, then back home, then back to Miami for New Year's, then back home, then back out this past weekend. Well, I just got back yesterday. So, yeah, <laughs> this is what it is right now. And I'm just like, no, I just cannot do it. <laughs> like, I just can't. So, I'm going to tackle these clothes. Also, um, want to just have things organized for my dresser it does get here so I can have aside the clothes that are going in the dresser, clothes that are just specifically to be hung up in the closet and all of the clothes out of my laundry room as well. So that is that, um, vlog went live at 8.30, like I said, oh, it probably went up at like 8.35. Um, so you guys seem to be enjoying that. It was a quick little vlog from my New York, I mean New York, New Year's trip to Miami. Um, a little bit of footage before then. And then I have another vlog that's probably going to go up. I'm thinking probably Saturday, Friday or Saturday. Um, and this that vlog is going to be basically the beginning of my new year. Like my first day back from Miami. Um, so, yeah. Your girl is consistent on top of vlogging right now for this vlog. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, I'm about to... Uh, take a shower, zen myself. Hopefully I don't get tired to fall asleep because I am tired and after the yoga, I feel like I could go to sleep right now. But I really, really want to get these clothes done because I'm supposed to be getting my extensions tomorrow. My taping's back in at three and I'm really still debating y'all. I really might still cancel. I'm not sure if I really just want to put them back in my hair just yet. But I just, you know, it just gives a different type of, it's just, I just feel like it's my look, you know? I don't know. And my hair just, my hair has grown so much. It's so filthy right now. But my hair has grown so much. Like, like it's grown about that much in like a month, month and a half. It's a lot. So, yeah. See if I'll catch y'all in like 2.5 seconds tonight or I'm going to catch y'all tomorrow morning.
so this is what we are looking like dropping my baby off right Lulu giving you a groom today honey so yeah this is our little pit stop first move errand of the day literally in my PJs in my PJs with my coffee along with me because I'm going to stay back home after um I was just in my bed journaling um and also online shopping I'm also trying to find an outfit because I'm have plans this weekend some festivities going out festivities here and um I know she's gonna go so I'm trying to look for an outfit, but I also feel like I have clothes at home. I just need to really tackle my closet. Let me answer my mother. Hello? Hi, baby. Oh, y'all want to call me now? Uh-uh, uh-uh, don't go there. Y'all want to call me now? Uh-uh, don't go there, girl. I'm not talking about you. I'm talking about dad. Uh I didn't call you. Well, you were part of the call. Because you there. Because yeah, you was but kicking me off. I'm dropping Louie off at his hair appointment. I don't got to get out of the car. <laughs> right. Do not hate. What is the point of putting on clothes? I got It's a nice little cute PJ set. Whatever. Straight. Get on. Yeah, and I'm going to tell them all how you be talking to me, too. He asked okay. the wrong questions, Louie. Uh-oh, he's like, uh-oh, they coming to get me. Uh-huh. Just wanted to show y'all what my table looks like during the day. It's not much sunlight in here. And the only sunlight it gets is from in, coming from my beauty room, bedroom, beauty room. So, yeah, I still really like it though. Such a vibe. So cute. I do wish the table was bigger, longer. Um, so I don't know what I'm really going to do, what I should do. Um, I really wish it came to like, pretty much like to like here. I wish it did, but whatever it'll do. This is not my forever home. I was thinking maybe like a bookshelf or something right here in the corner. Like a little ladder, black little, I don't know, something. So I'm about to walk into my appointment. Take a nice and just put back in. It's about to be long break. Long hair break and middle part bust down. You know, huge. <laughs>
kind of shut that cut off because ain't no hair out of place. No. <laughs> yes. I love it. I like it. Hair free. I do. Show the back one more time. Yes. Yes. I'm back home. This is the comb I was looking for. I got this one too. And as y'all saw, I got my hair cut. And we went short. This is the shortest I've gone since I cut my hair. Literally like right above my shoulder. And I'm just so happy. It's so cute. Literally perfect. Um, <laughs> yeah, I was like, oh yeah, breathe middle, breathe bust down middle part, long hair, about to be full in action. Then I'm like, you know what? I haven't even really gave the bob of like vibe for real. Haven't really like, you know, gave it a try, really played around with it. So why not? And my hair is growing so fast. Like, we cut off an inch, about a good inch today. Um, our hair was about right here today. And I cut it, this is like my either my fourth or fifth time now cutting my hair since October. So if I haven't cut my hair at all since October, my hair would probably have been down to like right here by now, like for real. So, I think I'm gonna let it grow finally after this. And then by the time I was like, you know what? Maybe I should just get extensions now because, you know, before it gets hot. But honestly, I'm just going with the flow at this point and maybe I'll let it grow out, maybe I won't. But I'm just loving it. It's so cute and short and I just love it. And it just feels so good to just have nothing in my hair. And honestly, it takes me all of about 30 minutes in total to do my hair myself. Blow drying takes maybe 15 to do my hair. So, yeah, we're just gonna keep it short for now. It's super, super cute, love it. And everybody literally is telling me to keep my short hair. I'm the one that keeps saying I wanna put my extensions back in. I literally almost got braids for New Year's and I'm like, braids for New Year's, not bad. Um, maybe if I was going on like a Rhode Island and not Miami, I would've got braids for real. But I ended up literally canceling day of and was like, I'm just wearing my natural hair. Was gonna get extensions, but everybody was like, no, keep your short hair. Like, it's grown sexy, perfect for New Year's. So I was like, okay, kept it. Made my appointment for today to get my long extensions back. And, you know, came out with the bob. So, literally brought all my hair and put not one pack in my hair. <laughs> so, at least I'm just, you know, loving my hair right now and it's like I want long hair, but then again, I don't want to deal with the maintenance of tapings. I don't want to mess up my hair. Like my hair just seems to really just be like super healthy and it seems to be getting thicker and you know, the breakage that was up here has pretty much grown out significantly. So it's all even now. So I just said, you know what, I'm gonna be a bad bitch and wear my real hair. Like I feel like, you know, Give it a spin. It's only been like three months and I don't even really wear my hair. I don't really post much. Don't really show much. A lot of the time my hair's in a bun or it just looks crazy on here or it's dirty. Like it's never nice like this for real. Ever on camera I feel like. So I'm gonna just you know give it a little spin a little longer but I'm glad I actually like have gone through so many levels of this haircut. This is the shortest. Um, I was gonna go a little shorter, but then we're like, we don't wanna do Dora. We don't wanna give Edna, you know? So I think this is like the perfect thing. She did so good, Kalia did so good. Like, and this is her first time doing natural hair in a really long time only, and a bob. So shout out to my girl, her new, well, she, her, it's not a new salon, but she redecorating it's redecorating, redoing her salon, and it's looking so good. It looks fire. I literally love what she did to her walls. Like, I want to do that to my walls right now. Um, I'm like, I'm about to do that downstairs in my living room. I'm about to do that in my beauty room. Like, what? Bedroom. 
Can't wait until I own. If I own one day. I may never own. I may rent the rest of my life. Who knows? I may wait for my husband, the man of my dreams, the father of my children, and we may be a house together. Who knows? But I gotta stop putting so much into this house, even though I haven't really done much, but I do realize, you know, still renting. But painting isn't bad, like, you know? So I don't know, we'll see. But <clears throat> you know what? I might do it in here, to be honest, because this wall right here, like, it's so plain. Like, it's so plain, and I don't want to put, like, a picture or anything right there, but it's just so plain. It's just so plain. And, like, the way I do my videos sometimes, like, I'm going to have it this way, and it's just so plain. And I just feel like the wall in my living room where the pictures are, like, once I feel like I get the curtains up, hopefully, which will be done tomorrow, because my dress, I guess, here tomorrow, too, and I have someone coming out to build and do all of this stuff tomorrow. So hopefully, once those curtains are up, it makes a difference, and then we'll see... But the picture frames and the lights above the pictures actually really made a huge difference for that space. But I feel like it's still super, super plain. So maybe I'll just make that wall like kind of like its own little accent wall. You know? Or I could even paint the walls like how Kalia is in her salon on the walls in between my fireplace and TV where the cabinets are in my living room. I can just do the damn living room like that. I don't know. But anyways, I'm about to take a shower and pretty much that's it for my night. Tomorrow I have to get up early because my dresser is going to be here between either 7 or 11 a.m. Well, between 7 and 11 a.m. And then I need to go to the mall because I have a, two events. Well. This weekend, um, I'm going to a basketball game on Saturday night. Then I'm going out with friends after um, for this party. And then Friday, we have some festivity party, social things going on. And I need to find some outfits. And I know I have outfits, but my closet's in shambles. And I can't find shit that I want to wear. So I need to go to the mall and spend unnec unnecessary money. Because I can't find shit. Can't find nothing to wear out of all of the clothes I have. Nothing. So, yeah. That's in my night here. And I'll catch y'all tomorrow. You guys. My tree's still up, but it's okay. My dresser is here, you guys. And I'm about to unpack it. I think it's already built, honestly. And I thought I would have had to build it. Well, I was going to build it, but girl, let's get this thing open because mm -mm, I need to get going because I need a dresser, y'all. So let's see. It's giving that it might be built already. I hate these little foam things because they be everywhere. Let's bring all this up. Ah! Oh my god, Oh my god, it's so nice.
I just got in. I ordered this robe from Skin because I really like the one I have already, the brown one. But it's a medium, I think, and they're like super oversized in the robe. But I love it so much. It's just so soft. These were actually on sale, I didn't even know. It was only 90 bucks. So I got the gray one, and it's just such a vibe. Um, the brown one was sent to me, and like I said, I love it. It's so soft and comfortable, but this is just more of my, you know, color vibe. Oh, it's just so soft. I got this in a small, it was debated between a small and an extra small. So I'm like, okay, I don't want to get the extra small, and then it's like, like too tight. I don't think it would have been too tight, but it just my other one feels like a big ass blanket, which I love, but like the sleeves be in the way. Um, it was kind of long, so whenever I would come up the stairs, I kind of was stepping on it, and it was just really big. It was literally like a blanket with sleeves. All right, let's see, this one fits. Oh, it's literally a blanket. It literally feels like this blanket. This blanket on my bed. Love this color. Giving love. We love that. I'm just so happy I got my dresser. Like, I'm so happy I want to take a clothes. Y'all, my closet. It's so bad. I'm just like fishing. Look. Like, this is ridiculous, and it's not like I don't have any space. Like, that shit looks stuck. It's for the lights for the closet, but y'all, this is embarrassing. I can't wait to show y'all after, but it's not space and shit. I just don't have it organized. Like, this is ridiculous, y'all. Ridiculous. Re fucking ridiculous. I'm about to get it right and get it tight and get it all in here. Well, not all of it, but some in there, some in here. Woo! This is gonna be probably the biggest house task. The biggest house task since I lived here. I'm gonna show y'all these um, before I forgot, but I got these panties off Amazon and they're so comfortable. They're the two ladies, I'll leave a link down below. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven panties for $20, like $19.99 on Amazon. These are a medium, but I'm about to order a small. I thought I ordered a small, but they fit, but in the back of right here, it kind of comes off my butt a little bit so a small will be just right like they're a little loose they'll still work but I love thongs like this because they're seamless you know I wear a lot of leggings and things like that so I need yeah but I, this I ordered a second I ordered the ones with like the green grays charcoal colors for my next one so these are like the browns nudes some girl they're great This is not staying like this. I literally just stuck this here. <laughs> I really don't know why I did that, but yeah. I still have so much more to do. <sighs> y'all, this isn't even half of my clothes, like at all. Like literally, I have a load in the wash. Still have to go through all of these. All of these. To do laundry, getting rid of this pile, um, any hangers and everything. That's another reason why a lot of this stuff isn't done yet either because I need hangers. 
But my drawers, these are just like paintings and stuff. My drawers, I'm not like the best at like organizing like my drawers and stuff. Well, color coordinating and stuff because I just feel like, girl, no, let's be for real here. Yeah, yeah, I'm out for the night though. I have to get hangers. It looks like I got nothing done, but I actually got a lot done because, ooh, y'all. All of these clothes are new clothes that I've never worn and I've just stuck up here. Terrible. But anyways, I'm tired. I'm gonna start again tomorrow. Tomorrow's Saturday. I'm gonna finish out my day strong, finish up as much as I can. I gotta get up and go get some more hangers, finish a load of laundry. But I'll definitely have all this done by tomorrow. I'm going out with friends to hang out around like 10. So I have all day, literally. It's supposed to be a rainy day, so it would be a perfect day to do all of this. But good night.
Okay, so I made it to Home Goods, but I had made a stop. There was this Jamaican place by my house, and I was like, I don't know what I'm gonna eat because I'm going out with friends later. But let me get a beef patty until I figure out what I'm gonna eat. Went in there, and they don't have, I think it's like a newer place, so they don't have the beef patty machine yet. He said by like next month. So I was like, okay, cool. So I was like, please, because that's all I wanted. He's like, wait, wait, let me let you try something. He's like, you like jerk? He's like, you like spicy? I'm like, yeah. He's like, you like real spicy? I'm like, yeah. He's like, okay. So he literally just made me like oxtails, jerk chicken, and rice and peas, y'all. And he wanted me to taste it in there. And y'all, it's so good. And perfect timing because I'm hungry. I haven't eaten all day. And let me say it was on him. Not my camera about to die. Uh, mind you, I didn't even want all this. It's like, I need to lose weight. Spicy, y'all. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my goodness. Nah. It's too good. So spicy. Wow. Oh my god. Mmm. Delicious. Anyways, I'm about to go into home, get some hangers, head back home, finish some clothes. I want to try to find maybe like a TikTok. Maybe I'll do something for YouTube, I'm not sure. I'm doing my makeup. And then I'm going out around like 10, 10 30 K. It's going to be me in my house. We're going to Uber there. So I'm chill tonight. Not dressing up, not wearing heels. Very cash. I'm trying to think what I'm gonna wear. Hopefully, I can find something while I'm hanging up my clothes and organizing. But yeah, I'm out. My camera's about to die. I might not be able to take it on home goods, but I'm gonna get, I wanna get hangers. If I see something, I'll record it on my phone. But other than that, my camera's about to die. Super chill. It's raining outside. It's cold. So I feel like this would be perfect. I don't know what Kayla's doing. She's in the bathroom. You in the bathroom? Yeah. But that's it, girl. Turn some lights on. I'm so comfortable tonight. I love it. All right. So what do I need? I think I got everything. The Uber is like eight minutes away. Seven minutes away. 